Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I want to share with you how to make these pumpkins and candy corn Halloween banners. So for both of them, I'm going to be making a template with a piece of paper and a pencil. For the pumpkin, I'm going to be using this plate or bowl and I'm just going to mark the shape of it. I'm going to cut it, I'm going to fold it in half and I'm going to be working the face. However, I'm going to get rid of like the roundness of it by doing this. Just like two curved lines, if that makes any sense. And then I'm just going to cut it and then I'm going to continue with the face. I'm sorry, I feel like I'm the worst at explaining what I'm doing. But I just wanted to show you an easy way to have this even. Because I think pretty much we all know what a Halloween pumpkin looks like. So excuse me if I'm explaining like not really technical. For the eye, it's going to be like one full triangle. Then the nose is going to be half triangle. And the mouth is going to be like half mouth like this. Once I have that part of the face, I'm going to mark with my pencil uh, like the paper. Just as a reference and I'm just going to complete the mouth like this. It doesn't have to be perfect at all and then I'm just going to cut it like this. I'm going to be drawing the stem and cutting this. Now that I have my stencils I'm going to be using this orange cardboard and I'm going to trace the pumpkin with my pencil and I'm going to cut it. It's always a bit harder cutting through cardboard because it's hard. The same thing I'm going to be doing with the stem and then I'm going to be using this acrylic paint green one uh, brush and I'm going to paint this. I didn't have green cardboard. Then I'm going to be using some double-sided tape to just tape those two together. Then as far as for the candy corn, I'm going to be doing a template as well, folding a piece of paper in half. Then mark that much, this is how long I want it to be, then fold it in half just to mark the middle part. Then I'm going to trace a triangle pretty much from like the mark that I did towards the line that I drew. I'm going to cut it and this is going to be my template. Then I'm going to be tracing it onto my cardboard and then just cut it. I'm going to be painting this with yellow, orange in the middle because I find it's easier to just cut one shape and paint on that one shape. If you prefer to use like a colored cardboard, feel free to do that. You don't have to paint anything after. To make this a banner though, I'm going to be using some rope and this wooden clothes pins. And I'm just using some like tape to just hang it on the wall because I don't want to have like a bunch of like holes all over the walls. And then just place your pumpkins and uh, candy corns however you want. But yeah, this is pretty much it, guys. I really like them. I think they look so much fun. They're easy to make. They're affordable. And you can like mix and match as I did right here. But yeah, I really hope you like this idea. Nothing new that I'm sharing with you. I just want to show you how to do this. I really hope I'm not late for this. Halloween is just around the corner. Time is flying pretty much. But yeah. And yeah, I really hope you like them. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out more Halloween stuff that I have on my channel and subscribe for more. Let me know what you think of this one and share this. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye!